in this video i'm going to share a dynamic label column chart on which we can switch on the data label by just clicking on button and if you want we can switch off by clicking off button no further ado let's develop this chart step by step consider we have this data table to develop the chart the first thing we need to do we need to develop a small table the table name let's say off on and i will type on here and here will be the next row will be the off sorry i just need to remove the on and we just need to convert this to a table so i will press ctrl t to convert my table in header yes and the next column will be the value for the on i will type one and for the off i will type zero value now what we need to do we just need to click at the table and go to slicer and we need to create slicer based on on off okay the next thing we need to do we just need to write a subtotal function so if i just write subtotal function for the subtotal function which function you want to use so we want to use this 109 quotes some function and for the reference we will just define this table reference close the bracket hit enter and this will give one if i click on off this will give me only the off row because subtotal will exclude the hidden cell and if i click on so we get one now what we need to do we just need to copy this whole function control x to cut from here and now we will use this function to create data label i will insert new column and i will call this column data label here i will type a formula if my this value equal to one if this has if the result of the function become one we want the monthly say so we will click on b2 otherwise we don't want anything so we will include a null okay hit enter and drag this formula down i hope you understand till now now if i click off it will show me nothing if i click on it will show me the data label of course i need to format the data label in currency and i remove the zero okay the next thing we just need to click all of the data excluding data label insert chart on a chart i will select all chart in this case i will just select column chart and for the column chart i will click on the plus icon data label more options i will remove this value and i will value from sales and i will select all of my data label hit ok and this will show me the data label now we are almost ready if i click off this will off the data label if i click on this will show me the data label now i will show you how we can format this chart the first thing let me just move this chart to a proper location i will press alt key so that it fit on the cells so you can see when you press alt key it perfectly sit on the border of the cells the next thing we need to uh, move this slicer to upper area of the chart click on the slicer slicer sitting we don't want to display the header hit ok and now we need to decrease the height of the slicer we need to click on the columns and in this case we need to click on let's say four column or five column until it's not showing the text so five column is okay so that we get a blank area for the label we just need to adjust the area of the slicer the next thing we need to choose this slicer design you can choose any of the one right click on the chart format data series and the data sorry the gave width in this case we want let's say the 20 is okay or 15 whatever you want whatever you want you can choose those gave width and the next thing we need to go format in the format we need to use lighter color and if we on the data label we need to select all of the data label and for the data label i will choose darker color and of course i want to bold so that it's look nice click on the monthly sale chart title choose the dark color and of course this one as well so if you 
press f4 key this will apply the last action so i change the color and then i just click and hit f4 key and this automatically apply those color now we just need to hide this one so we just need to click and right click hide but you can see the data label has been off what we need to do click on the chart chart design select data hidden and empty show data with hidden row and column hit ok and hit ok now we are almost ready you can just move this slicer to a little right side of the chart and we need to insert text box inside the slicer here we will write label on off of course we need to uh, click shape format shape fill to no fill shape outline to no outline text fill to this dark color control b to bold so if we just off the grid line we are almost ready this is how we can create this nice chart with dynamic data label i hope you enjoyed this video please subscribe the channel for more video thank you so much